How you feeling? How's spring? Feeling great. I had a blast. It was super fun. So I had a great time. Uh, with uh, Coach Dryling, just how is that? Just the def defensive mindset, is it different much? Or just new pieces, new faces, just takes time to get familiar? Yeah, a lot of new, pace, uh, new pieces and new faces. I mean, it's, but it's been great. I feel like we've all been able to mesh together. You know, we're kind of flowing towards that brotherhood that we need to form. So, but it's been great. You know, a lot of new guys. Coach A's named a lot of new uh, new guys on the defensive side. So, but I mean, shoot, it's been it's been a blast so far. What do you feel have been the like? What do you feel have been the biggest strides you guys have made, kind of collectively as a defense uh, from beginning to the end of spring camp? Uh, I just think playing hard every play. You know, that's one thing we emphasize a lot, and just just going hard every play. I mean, we start off slow. But we like to finish strong. So, but yeah, I feel like we've definitely made a jump in that. We call it loafing, um, just not running the ball and stuff. But I feel like we've definitely gotten better at that. That's the main thing. So. You guys had a few big plays, forced a couple of turnovers, some sacks. How do you feel like with this defense's ability to be dynamic and make some of those big plays? Yeah, I mean, shoot, we got a lot of athletes on our side of the ball. It's 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 crazy. Um, so this defense that you know Coach Dryling put in, it's it's perfect. It fits us perfectly. You know, we can run, gun, and make plays, and that's really what it's about at the end of the day. Coach talks about developing the depth in the two deep and they're adding players through this last recruiting uh, process with the transfer portal and things like that. How do you feel like the, the depth of this team is now compared to where it was a year ago even after spring? Oh well, yeah, it's, it's great. I mean, obviously we've had a few people transfer out, but you know, the core, the core people on this team, you know, the majority of us have stayed and you know, our two deep, even three deep has been great. So. I'm, I'm excited to see what we can do, and it's always it's always great to have people you know behind you that are just as good as you. So, so what's it like like in the locker rooms? So sometimes guys transfer out. Sometimes maybe expect them to. Sometimes it's a surprise. Just what's it kind of like still going through spring practice and suddenly guys are making decisions to go elsewhere? Uh, yeah. I mean, it sucks. Like it, it, it definitely sucks. But you know, at the end of the day, those guys are going to make a decision that they think will fit them best and where they think they'll be successful and you know we just all got to respect that decision you know everybody that's transferred out we haven't you know talked bad about them we just we just hope they're successful because that's that's all we want as teammates right you know because we're, we're all close so we it's, it's been it's been sad but I mean we want what's best for everybody at the end of the day and that's if you got to leave to go if you got to leave and go somewhere else to play then you got to do what you got to do so just like scheme wise what have you guys done what have you implemented to kind of shore up that rush defense that was kind of a, maybe the biggest problem last year oh uh, yeah uh, it, honestly it, it it really doesn't have anything to do with the scheme it's just it's just the, the heart you know the, the players you know if you're gonna play hard you're gonna play hard and we got people that play hard so I mean that's the main thing yeah the scheme works but I mean honestly you're only doing the scheme for the first three three seconds of the of the play and then after that you're just running and gunning and playing football you know getting to the ball and we have that so we got a lot of hustlers on the team and you know that's why I think we're going to be great so you guys were dancing around a lot during the practice and everything talk me through a little bit about your guys's culture as a defense and kind of how it forms into a brotherhood oh uh, yeah man we just want to have fun I mean just Together and collectively, no matter what, you know, we're down 20 or up 20. Like, we're, we're going to celebrate and have fun together because I think that's the main thing. Um, just celebrating your brother's, you know, uh, accomplishments at the end of the day because, you know, that shows that you care for another person and then, you know, you're going to play for, you know, the person beside you and not just yourself. So, frankly, I like the sound of Ike wants to have fun a lot better than girls want to have fun. <laughs> the, me Maybe too. We, should change the lyrics there. we might have to. I got to hit up Snoop Dogg and uh, <laughs> Katy Perry. I got okay. to see what they can do with that. Anything else for Ike? Okay. Yeah.